How's everybody feeling out there? Feeling good? Ready to, ready to have a graduation here? All right. with its problems a bit easier to face. Grant me faith and courage and put purpose in my days and show me how to serve thee in the most effective ways. So all my education, my knowledge and my skill may find their true fulfillment as I learn to do thy will. And may I ever be aware in everything I do that knowledge comes from learning and wisdom comes from you. Turn to the flag for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America 
and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. I would like to introduce our headmaster, John Martin. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, everyone. And we want to welcome you to this, the conclusion of the 16th year of Nativity Prep School. And a great year it's been. Uh, I want to welcome our trustees. I want to welcome our families, our parents, our alumni who are scattered around, our mentors, our volunteers, our students, and of course, the graduating class of 2016. It's, uh, it's, been a, it's been a great year uh, in many, many ways, and we're going to talk about, single out some achievements that we've done over the last uh, nine or ten months. But before we do that, I think it's always important to look back in time a little bit, because uh, in 2000, a gentleman had a vision of what this school would be. Uh, it was a dream in his mind. He ended up sleeping here in this building, picking the building out, uh, attracting students, attracting donors. Uh, and that man is our founder, Barry Hines. And Barry, would you like to stand up? We'd like to recognize you. Barry had a vision, and I'm not quite sure even he dreamed it would be like this at, at the end of the day. But it's a powerful vision, and the gentlemen in front of us are testimony to what that vision can mean for our kids. Uh, and one other item I just want to mention is that this year, I believe we have John Keller retiring from the board. John has been one of the longtime trustees of this school. I ask Mr. Keller to stand and just thank him for all his efforts and his Every year, uh, we are blessed to have the Highland Street Foundation, which actually gave us this building three years ago, give us some money to donate to local philanthropic organizations. This allows our students to look at different organizations, to study them, to understand how philanthropy works. And the uh, Highland Street Foundation gives us $5,000 to do this. This year, uh, we're going to ask our uh, eighth grade class to come up front. And we have two gentlemen who are going to come up and announce uh, who our philanthropic winners are. The eighth grade class would like to present the first philanthropy award to Denison Memorial Community Center. We would like to welcome Mr. Sean Hargreaves, Executive Director of Denison Memorial, to receive the check from all of us in the eighth grade. Denison is a community-based organization serving the needs of boys and girls from the south end of New Bedford through day and evening programs of education and recreation. We want to thank Denison for their service to the community, and it's our pleasure to present Denison with this check for $2,500. Thank you for all you do, for all you do. The eighth grade class would like to present the second philanthropy award to Buttonwood Zoological Society. The we would like to welcome the director of the Buttonwood Zoo, Mr. Keith Lovett, to receive the award from the check of our eighth grade class. The Buttonwood Zoo is a tremendous asset to our community, providing programs throughout the year for school children, allowing them to experience and appreciate our natural world. It is with our great pleasure that the eighth grade class presents a check of $2,500 to the Buttonwood Zoo. Thank you for all your due to the community. All right, guys, go back and have a seat. Thanks, Jamal and Chandler. That was great reading right there. Good job. Uh, next, 
We would like to present the Ignatius Awards for others on behalf of the Nativity Prep community. This award is given in honor of people who, in the spirit of St. Ignatius Loyola, have graciously bestowed upon our school many gifts that God has bestowed upon them. Today we would like to express our gratitude to two people for their acts of benevolence on behalf of our school and their fervent belief in and the commitment to the fulfillment of our mission. Bernie Kenny is the owner of a local Dunkin' Donuts franchise and since 2006 has generously donated product to Nativity Prep for all of its events. A professor at Johnson and Wales University in Rhode Island, he has graciously hosted many Nativity alumni at the university in association with our Summer Bridges program. Bernie, thank you for all you do for our community. Please come on up on stage. Our second award recipient, Sheila Grady, is a career educator who has forever had our backs during hectic social studies classes or fair projects. Sheila has always provided direction, support, and encouragement to our students and has had a remarkably positive impact on the development of our teachers over the years. Sheila, we are eternally grateful for your help. Thank you for all that you do for us. Please come up on stage. Next up, one of my favorite parts always, the choral interlude. I would like to invite the Nativity Prep Choir up to the front of the stage, please. Led by Miss Raina St. Louis. Thank you. 
Thank <laughs> you.